Check here is okay. So now we can start. Okay, you can use any prop if you need to. Okay. Today we will practice some uh, mantra together with Karapura uh, Goram together. Okay, sit comfortable as you wish. We can start from now. Okay, you can sit in Sukhasana, Padmasana, whatever you feel comfortable. Okay. The important thing is lengthen your spine, lower your shoulder back and down. Okay, slowly cram your mind for a moment. Close your eyes. Palm facing together in front of your heart. Take a nice deep inhale. Oh Om Karpura Karam Karuna Vataram Sansara Saram Bhushakendraharam Sada Vasantam Hiriya Ravinde Pavam Pavani Sahitam Namami Karpura Karam Karuna Vataram Sansara Saram Shakendra Haram Sada Vasantam Hiriya Ravinde Pawam Pawani Sahitam Namami Garpura Goram Karuna Vataram Sara Saram Bushakendra Haram Sada Vasantam Hiriya Ravinde Pawam Pawani Sahitam Namami Pawam Pawani Sahitam Namami Pawam Pawani Sahitam Namami Om Namah Shivaya Om Namah Shivaya Om Namah Shivaya Bring your thumb to your forehead Slowly exhale down. We connect ourselves to the universe, the nature, to the Lord Shiva, our first yoga teacher, to our master, our guru, our teacher, our parents. Namaste, everyone. Okay, let me check quick. Okay, now my mom said it's okay. Okay, now we start with warm up. Before we warm up, I would like to tell you that it's always that before you practice or after you practice, you should have mindfulness. Listen to your body, okay? When you practice, try to be mindfulness, gentle to yourself, gentle to your body, okay? So we will not over, uh, straight over our limit, okay? One day maybe it will come, so no need to force at all, okay? So now you can slowly lie on your back, okay? You can put your feet together, okay? Feel free to take any blanket or any blocks under your knees. We stay in Supta Baddha Konasana here for a moment. The hands can to your belly or to your thighs.
Just keep breathing. Okay. This is a great pose for to open, open our hips too. Okay, now slowly grab your thighs and put your knees together and bring your knee to your chest. You can rock side to side a couple times here. And now you, we will circle the knees, okay? The first one is go to the clockwise. Inhale, exhale, round. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. And now reverse that. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, come back to the center. Now we will open our hips. Inhale, knees to your chest. Exhale, open your knees, go to the side. And knee down. Inhale, come up to your chest. Exhale, open your hips. Knees down. Inhale, come to your chest. Exhale, open your knees, go down. And come up. Now we reverse side. Inhale, knees to your chest. Exhale, knee down, open to the side, and come up to your chest. Inhale, exhale, knee down, open your knees, and come up to your chest. Inhale, exhale, down, inhale, come up. One more time. Inhale, exhale. Now bring your knee to the chest. You can grab big toe or grab right this. Okay, open your knees and rock side to side. This is level one, okay? Level two, if you feel comfortable, you can bend your right knee and straight your left leg. Or you can bend your left leg and straight your right knee. This is level two, okay? Level three, if you feel comfortable, you can spread your legs like this and rock side to side. Remember, Okay, no force at all. Stay at your own pace. Okay, if you feel comfortable, you do wish you are very suitable for you. Okay, keep breathing. And now inhale, bring the knee to your chest. Okay, now slowly knee, put your feet out to the floor and bend your knees, bring your knee to the chest and grab your right ankle over your over your left thigh, okay? Interest your finger under your hamstring, left hamstring. Inhale, put the knee to your chest. We're stretching now here. Your hip joints, hip flexor, your groin. Keep breathing, stay here for a moment. Still continuing, keep breathing. Okay, now exhale, release. We change to the other side. Okay, bring your knee to the chest, grab your left ankle over your right thigh, interest finger, inhale, slowly bring the knee to the chest, keep breathing. Okay, feel very good, right? Very nice, everyone. Especially when you work the whole day. After that, after work, you can open your hips. Okay, now exhale, release. Now bring both legs to the floor. Inhale, lift your right leg up. You can use the strap, okay? Or if not, you grab your big toe here. And straight. Feel a lot of stretching hamstring here. Keep breathing. 
Now exhale slowly, no need to force, okay? Maybe level when you are here, level two here, level three. If you can slowly go to down to the floor, your hips stay here on the floor. No need to force yourself. You can look to the opposite side, okay? And now slowly bring the knee, come up. Okay, you can grab both through the shin bones and slowly come up like this. Straight maximum here. Keep breathing. Okay, slowly down. Now shin to the other side. Inhale, left leg up. Grab big toe with left hand or use strap. Feel free to use strap, okay? Inhale, straight so much as you can here. Feel really good. And now exhale slowly, maybe level one here, okay? Level two, maybe here, level three, maybe you can slowly go down. And look to the other side. Keep breathing. Now inhale, slowly come up to the center. Grab your shin bone here and slowly come up. Straight your hamstring. Keep breathing. Okay, now slowly exhale down. Okay, now you can bend your knees and drop to the side. And slowly come up. Okay. Uh, we will do some titterly. Okay, you can sit in titterly and we will shake our leg here like this, okay? So maybe you can do fly high, interest finger and round your back, fly high. Or if you feel comfortable, you do like this. Okay. Now slowly spread your legs like this. We will do a cat here in the sit position. Okay, first inhale, tie one out, arch your back, look up. Every time when you inhale, you see, you can st stretch a little bit here. Exhale, round your back, tie one in, chin to chest. Inhale, slowly arch your back, look up, keep breathing. Exhale, roll your back, chin to chest. One more time. Inhale, roll, arch your back, look up. Exhale, roll your back, chin to chest. Inhale, come back to the center. Okay. Now, inhale, thumbs up. You can exhale, twist to the right side. Okay. Maybe you can be here, also use fingertip here or here, depending on which one you like. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, twist. To the left side, keep breathing. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, twist to the right side. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, twist to the left side. One more time, inhale, thumbs up, exhale, twist to the right side, right side. Inhale, thumbs up, exhale, twist to the right side. Inhale, thumbs up, exhale, release. Now, interest the finger like this, we will do Chucky Sanjali. We start from clockwise first, so it's mid inhale, exhale, go to this is great for to open your hips, okay? Inhale, exhale. Okay, if you feel it too much for you, you can a little bit come. No need to be so, it's too much open, okay? Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. One more time. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. One more time. 
Inhale, exhale. Okay, inhale, come back to the center. And slowly come to Titali again. Okay. And now we will bend the left knee and straight your right leg. Okay? You can straight here like this. Now inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, side bend to the right side. Maybe you are here. It's okay, okay? Maybe you are here. But important thing is both hips to the floor. Okay, slowly maybe you are here. Or maybe you can grab like this. But no need, okay? Like this is okay. Inhale, come up. Exhale, now twist to the left side. You can use fingertips like this. Straight. Inhale, stop. Exhale, side bend to the right side. Keep breathing. Right here is also okay. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, twist to the left side. Keep breathing. One more time. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, side bend to the right side. Okay. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, twist to the left side. Keep breathing. Inhale, thumbs up. Now exhale. Use your right hand, grab your left ankle. Inhale, lengthen the spine. Exhale, slowly. Side bend to the right side. Maybe you can grab or maybe you are here. It depends on your flexibility, but no need to force. If you are here, it's fine too. I feel a lot of stretching in my side body and hamstring. Inhale, come up one more time. Exhale, slowly side bend to the right side. Okay, great job. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, release. Now we change to the other side. Bend your right knee and slowly straight here. Okay. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, now we twist to the right side first. Okay. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, side bend to the right. Slowly, slowly. Feel a lot of stretching here. Your hamstring too, right? Okay, inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, twist to the right side. Keep breathing. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, side bend to the right side. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, twist to the right side. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, side bend to the right side. Left side. Inhale, thumbs up. Now use your left hand, grab your right ankle. Inhale, exhale slowly. Maybe you are here, that's why. Or you can grab and look it up. Inhale, thumbs up. Now exhale slowly, side bend to the left side. Keep breathing. You can look here, you can put the elbow down too. Okay, inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, release. Okay, you can do a little bit here for butterfly, uh, titterly now here, okay? Now, you can cross your leg and turn to the side, come to Majaliyasana. Okay, tuck your toes, look, take your alignment, knees, hips apart. Hands, shoulder distance. Okay, look at your shoulder to your wrist and the hip to your knees. Inhale, tie bone out slowly, belly down, arch your back, look up, shoulder down, keep breathing. Exhale, untuck your toe, tie bone in, draw your back, chin to chest. Don't forget, try to be gentle to your spine, no need to force. Inhale. Tuck your toes, arch your back, look up. Exhale, untuck your toe. And draw your back, chin to chest. One more time, inhale, tuck your toe. Tie one out, arch your back, look up. Exhale, untuck your toe. Tie one in, draw your back, chin to chest. 
Inhale, come back to the center. Okay, now tuck your toes and slowly come to Bhavaratasana or Mountain Pose. If it's your first downward Bhavaratasana uh, or Mountain Pose, okay, you can bend your knees and walking in place, okay. Now, you can straighten your shoulder here also a little bit, okay. Now inhale, right leg up, bend your knees, open your hip, exhale, knee to your nose. And now we will circle our hips, okay. Inhale, out, inhale, exhale, inhale, come in, exhale, out, inhale, come in, exhale, out. And now we leave the side. Inhale, knee to the nose. Exhale, come out. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Now release, like leg down. Inhale, left leg up. Bend your knees, open your hips. Exhale, knee to your nose. Now we will circle our Hips, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale. Now reverse side, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, inhale, exhale, release. And now... Inhale, right leg up. Exhale, slowly put your right foot forward to Ashwasana Asana. Okay. And then slowly left knee down to the floor. Okay. So you can use spring technique also for to straighten your leg here, your hips here. Okay. Use spring technique here first. Okay. Now when you are ready, left knee down to the floor. Level one, maybe you are here. Okay. Level two, you can untuck your toe and slowly go down here. Okay. You can open your hips a little bit and drop side to side. Okay. Now slowly inhale, come up. Okay. Now you can tuck your toe or flat your toe. It depends on your flexibility, okay? Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, interest your finger. Touch your hands to your knees. Okay, inhale up. Exhale down. Straight here, your hips flex. So as muscle, inhale. Exhale. Inhale. Exhale. One more time. Inhale. Exhale. And now hands to the floor and slowly straight your front leg, okay? And inhale here. If you can do slowly, slowly go down. If not, no problem. Try to square, hip square here. Keep breathing. Okay, now bend your knees, tuck your toe and step your right foot back to Bharatasana, Mountain Pose. Keep breathing here. Inhale, left leg up. Exhale, slowly bring the left foot forward to Ashwasana Asana. You can use spring technique to straighten your hips here. Okay. And now slowly drop right knee down and tuck your toe. Level one, maybe you are here, okay? Level two and level three, you can slowly Put the hands down. You can rock your hips from side to side here. Keep breathing. Okay. Now slowly come back to the center. We can adjust here. You can tuck your toes or flat your toe here. Depends on you, okay? Inhale, thumbs up, interest your finger, put the hands to your left knee, inhale up, exhale slowly down here. 
Inhale up. Exhale slowly down here. I feel a lot of stretching in hip flexor in the psoas muscle here. Open your hips. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Now slowly hands to the floor and slowly stretch your left leg. Okay. You can flex your toe here. Look at the hip square. Inhale here. Exhale. Maybe you can do it slowly. Put your head down. Keep breathing. Stretch your hamstring here. Okay, slowly bend your knees, tuck your back toe, and slowly step your left foot back to Paratasana Mountain Pose. Keep breathing. Okay, now inhale, look forward. Exhale, slowly walk to your hands. Grab your ankles and slowly look side to side a couple times. Exhale, release your hand down to the floor and inhale, slowly bend your knee and come up to Samatiti. Okay. So you stand to the top of your mat in Samatiti. Yeah. Tie bone in, belly in, lengthen the spine, lower your shoulder back, ground the floor with your feet. Okay. Inhale, thumbs up, palm facing up. Inhale, straight your arm. Turn bone out, exhale, lengthen your spine, slowly come down to Padahastasana, bend your knees, exhale, slowly step your right foot back to, look at your 45 degree, look, look at your right heel 45 degree, okay? If you cannot do it, you can slowly come out from the center of the mat, okay? Take your variation self, okay? Inhale, slowly come up to warrior one. Okay, maybe you are here. Inhale, thumbs up, shoulder down. Okay, or maybe you are here. Which level you like? Level one, level two, level three. Okay, now slowly exhale, turn your right heel 90 degree. We come to warrior, warrior two, Vilapadasana two. Okay, check your alignment, your hips go to the side, tie bone in, belly in, front knee 90 degree, okay, and arms by your side, palm facing up, slowly internal rotate here, and come back. The body not go forward, the body go lengthen and straight. And now slowly exhale, straight your left leg, we come to Trikonasana. Okay, and slowly, level one, maybe your hands to your hips, and slowly, slowly, come like this. Level two, maybe here. Okay, level three, maybe you can use the block. Level two, level three, maybe hands down to the floor. If you have hyper uh, knees, you can micro bend here, okay? Okay, now. Exhale slowly, right hand down, left hand beside your left foot, and slowly now you turn your back foot, come to Pashwotanasana, pyramid foot pose. Okay, you are here, you can stay here. Okay, keep breathing, inhale, exhale slowly down. If it's too far for you, you can step your back foot a little bit here. Okay, adjust yourself which one comfortable for you. Keep breathing, and now slowly we will do a uh, Parilita Trikonasana. Okay, now inhale slowly. Right, a uh, left arm up. Keep breathing. Exhale, left arm down, and bend your knee. Step your left foot back to Paratasana Mountain Pose. Keep breathing. Okay, now we change to the other side, okay? Exhale, heels off the floor, step your right foot forward. Okay, left heel 45 degree, okay? It's just yourself, maybe you have to come out from the middle of the mat here like this, or you stay here, okay? 
Slowly inhale, thumbs up. Two, will up Badasana. One, or warrior one. Inhale, thumbs up. Shoulder down. Okay. Level two here. Level three here. Check your alignment. Hips to the front. Hips square. Belly in, tailbone in. Front knee, 90 degree. Okay, now slowly exhale. Villa Padrasana 2, warrior 2. Slowly turn your back foot 90 degree, okay? Front knee 90 degree, back foot 90 degree. Hips go to forward here. Tie bone in, belly in. Arms by your side. Palm facing up. Internal rotate here. And come back. Okay. Exhale now, extend your right leg to, we will do Trikonasana or Triangle, okay? Maybe level one hands to your hips. Slowly now, you can grab your thigh. Or level two, you can use the block or the shin bone and thumbs up. Keep breathing. Or level three and slowly here or here. Okay, keep breathing. Now exhale, left hand down, right hand outside of your left toe. We slowly turn, come to pyramid pose, or we call Pashwantanasana. Okay, maybe if it's too far for you, you can step. Come here a little bit, okay? So now inhale, lengthen the spine, exhale, slowly bend forward. Keep breathing. Okay, very nice. Now we do... Uh, Parilita Trikonasana, inhale, right arm up, slowly, exhale, right arm down, bend your knees, step your right foot back to Bharatasana, mountain pose, keep breathing, ground off with your fingers, belly in, hips high, you can use spring technique to put your forehead down to the floor, exhale, now knees, chest chin down to Guru Namaskarasana, Keep breathing, elbow not out, elbow to your body. Exhale, hips down, feet down, feet together or separate, it's okay. Inhale, slowly come up to Bhujangasana. Lower your shoulder back and down, keep breathing. Okay, now exhale, chest down, tuck your toes and slowly come up to Bhavratasana, mountain pose. Okay, now exhale, use all the floor, step your right foot forward. Back foot, forward to Padastasana. Inhale, slowly arms up. Exhale, release your arms down. Okay, now I show you this side first. And then you can see much better here. Okay? Now, inhale, arms up. Exhale, slowly bend forward down. Hands down to the floor. Bend your knee. Step your right foot back. Two, we will do warrior two, Villa Padasana, okay? Right heel 90 degree, right arm up, and slowly come to warrior two. Check your alignment. Look at your hips square, and to the other side, tie bone in, belly in, front knee 90 degree, arms by your side, palm facing up, Slowly rotate, internal rotate here and come back. Okay, not go forward, not lean forward, but straight. Okay, now left palm up, inhale, reverse warrior. Viparita Virasana, you can grab your hamstring here or your calf muscle here. Keep breathing. Okay, now exhale, now slowly. Come to Uttita Pashva Konasana. Level one, maybe you can take easy here. Okay, look that front knee 90 degree. Or you can use a block here. Or the hands down to the floor. Keep breathing. Exhale. Inhale, slowly come back to Warrior Two. And this time now, you can use the block over your left knee, around 20 centimeters. Okay, slowly take your time, no rush. If it's too far for you, you can step your right foot near a little bit. Slowly lean forward, left hand down, and slowly come up. 
Maybe you are here. Okay? And slowly, if you can do, grab your ankle. It's not stay where you are. Keep breathing, look up. Exhale slowly, release. Now you can slowly put your hands down and straight. Maybe you are here, okay? It's no need to force. Just stay at your own pace. Maybe you are here, doesn't matter. Exhale slowly, right leg down. And inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, hand down to the floor. Step your left foot, foot back to Pavaratasana Mountain Pose. Keep breathing. You can use spring technique to put your forehead down to the floor. Okay, now slowly, heels off the floor. Step your right foot forward. Okay, left heel. 90 degree and slowly left hand up, right hand up to Vila Pradasana 2, Warrior 2. Check your alignment. Hips to the side, tight bone in, belly in, front knee 90 degree and palm facing up still. A little bit internal rotate and come back. Not lean forward, okay? Straight like this. Shoulder down. Right palm up, inhale, reverse for you. Viparita Virasana, level one, maybe here, here, here. Grab your hamstring here. Or you can grab the calf muscle here. Okay, now slowly. Exhale, we do Pashiva, Utita Pashiva Kunasana, level one, maybe here. Take nice and easy here. Front knee 90 degree, or use the block. Level two, level three here. Keep breathing all the time. Okay, now inhale, slowly come back to warrior two. Okay. Now this time, take the block over your right foot around 20, cent 10, 20 centimeters. Okay, and take your time, slowly lean, shift the weight forward to the right, and slowly come up. Take your time, no need to rush, okay? If you fall down, you come back and make again. Nobody cares that you will fall down, okay? It's your own practice. Maybe you grab your ankles and look up. Exhale, release your leg and both hands near your right foot. You can do standing spread here. Maybe you are here, that's fine. Or here, or here. Keep breathing. No need to force. Exhale now, left knee, left foot down to the floor. Inhales, thumbs up. Exhale, hands down to the floor. And step your right foot back to Bhavratasana Mountain Pose. Keep breathing. Exhale, knees, chest in down to the floor. To Guru Namaskarsana, elbows to, to your body. Exhale, chest down, feet down. And hips down, feet together or separate. Inhale slowly. Come up to Bhushanka, roll your shoulder back and down. Exhale, chest down, tuck your toes. And slowly come to Bhavratasana, mountain pose. You can take your time now to use spring technique. Put your forehead down. Keep breathing. And don't forget to soften your face. This is great. Ah, uh, no. Heels off the floor, step your right foot forward, back foot forward. Inhale slowly, arms up. Exhale now, slowly. Phone forward, hands down to the floor. Inhale, exhale, bend your knee. Slowly step your right foot back. Right heel down to 90 degree. And slowly come up. Hands to your hips, to your waist. Slowly turn your left foot to 90 degree here. Okay. Hands to your hip. Tie bone out, lengthen your spine, hands down. Maybe level one, you, you are here, okay? Move side to side. Yeah. Level two, level three, you can slowly bend your right knee and straight your left leg and Flex your left foot here. Keep breathing. 
Inhale, come back to the center. Exhale, bend your left knee. Straight your right leg. Don't forget to flex your right foot, okay? Okay, now inhale, come back to the center. And now go to the right side again. Inhale, flex your left foot. Inhale, come back to the center. And now bend your left leg, bend your left knee and flex your right leg. Okay, now inhale, come back to the center. Slowly hands to your hips and turn your left foot forward. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, hands down to Ashwasana Jalinasana. And step your left foot back to Bhavratasana Mountain Pose. Keep breathing. Exhale, lift your heels. Step your right foot forward to Ashwasana Jalinasana. Left heel. 90 degree and slowly come up hands to your hips and now turn your right foot 90 degree now here okay tie bone out lengthen the spine slowly come hands down to the floor level one maybe you are only here okay just move and open your hips now here level two three you can slowly bend your right knee now here and straight your left leg and flex your left foot too. Inhale, come back to the center. Exhale, now bend your left knee, straight your right leg, flex your right foot. Inhale, come back to the center. Exhale, now slowly bend your right knee and straight your left leg, flex your left foot. Inhale, come back to the center. And slowly inhale, come up, hands to your hips. And slowly turn your right foot forward. Inhale, thumbs up. Exhale, hands down. Come to Ashwasana Jalinasana. Exhale, step your right foot back to Bhavratasana, Mountain Pose. Keep breathing. You can stay here for a moment too. Don't forget, feel free to take a break. You can... Sip some water if you need to, and come back to practice again. Don't force yourself. This is your own practice. Okay, now heels off the floor. Step your right foot forward, back foot forward to Pada Hastasana. Inhale slowly, arms up. Exhale, hands by your side. Okay, now this time, inhale, arms up. Exhale, slowly bend forward. Bend your knees, step your right foot back. Okay, to Ashwasana Jalinasana. And right heel down to 90 degree and slowly come up. Okay, now turn your left heel to 90 degree parallel together. Okay, so this time I hope that Okay, everyone is fine, right? This time, take your time, no need to force, okay? Every asana who is difficult for you, you need time. It will not happen today, but if you practice regularly, it will come, okay? So take your time, no force. Listen to your body, okay? Maybe level one, you are here. Okay, and slowly wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle your feet and slowly come maybe you're here that's fine that's great no need to uh, straight more than your flexibility that your ability to do it because after that you will get injury so we practice with smart okay so slowly 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 maybe you are here slowly go down nice and easy keep breathing Okay, maybe you are here and you can slowly go down here or you can slowly go down here keep breathing for those of you who 
cannot still cannot come down. You can use spring technique, use the block a little bit, but be gentle. No force and no jerk. Okay, be gentle. Listen to your body all the time. Okay. Now inhale, slowly come up. Slowly come up. After this, we can slowly, slowly come to Titari. Quick here. Okay. And now bring the knee together here. And you can drop the knee side to side here. Okay, for those of you who in the you know, if you're still here, right? You can very easy wiggle, wiggle, wiggle here. Wiggle here like this and slowly sit down here, same. Do like this, okay? Inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, come back to the center. And now you can hug your knees, hold your knee like this, round your back. And then put your right foot over your left foot here like this. And come here in front. Inhale, lift it up. Exhale here, down here like this. We do vinyasa here. Okay. Exhale, knee, chest, chin down to the floor. Inhale, slowly come to Bhujangasana. Okay. Exhale, chest down, tuck your toes, and slowly come to Pavaratasana, Mountain Pose. You can stretch your shoulder here. Don't forget, ground the floor with your fingers firmly. Tie bone, belly in, and soften your face. Keep breathing. Okay, now heels off the floor, and slowly exhale, step your right foot forward. Back foot forward to Padahastasana. Inhale slowly, arms up. Okay, now exhale. Hands together, palms together in front of your heart. Slowly bend your knee and slowly come down. Now hands to your knees to Kakasana here. Okay, now hips down to the floor. Maybe do Navasana, level 1, maybe you are here, level 2 here, level 3, maybe you can straight your leg like this, okay, use your core muscle here, keep breathing, okay, now slowly, slowly, and slowly down, use your core muscle, slowly down, 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 down here. Okay, two shavasana. This is your relaxing time. So let your body get a deep relaxation now here. Release the whole tensions in your body. Just around your body, get the deep relaxation. Relax. Release the tension in your eyeballs. Your eyeballs. Your lips. Your jaws. Your shoulders. Your hips. Your thighs. Your feet. Just release, relax, and
Now slowly bring your awareness back to your body. You can start slowly move your hands, your feet, your arms, your legs. legs. You can bring the feet together. Inhale, sound drop over your head. And stretch your fingers over your head and straight. Maximum like you wake up in the morning. And breathe. Exhale, release. You can hug your knees, bring the knees to your chest and rock side to side to massage your back. Okay, when you are ready, slowly move to the side, any side as you wish. When you are ready, slowly come up to sit position. Okay, take your time, no rush. After practice asana, yoga asana, we will practice pranayama together. Okay. Okay. Sit comfortable as you wish. You can sit sukhasana, padmasana. Lengthen your spine, lower your shoulder back, and down. Okay. Today we will do a kapal body pranayama together. As I think everybody know already, right? Kapal is mean face, body is mean shining. So face shining. We can detox our body from inside out. It improves also for the skin problems, wrinkles. It helps to sharp memory too, and it's great for. The immune system, but for caution, for pregnant women should not do this, and for high blood and low blood pressure, should take not more than twenty times in one or two rounds. Okay, now I show you first. You can do mudra like this or like this. Okay, we focus on the exhale. So you let it inhale automatically. After inhale, wait for two, three seconds. After you exhale and pump the air out. Okay, so like this. Wait for two, three seconds. You inhale like this, and now. Okay, we do six rounds together at your own pace. Okay. Finish. You can slowly close your eyes, calm your mind. You stay here for a moment. Keep breathing. Don't worry about anything. Just let it go and breathe. Slowly bring your awareness back in front of your heart. Can put your hands 
palm facing together in front of your heart. We will finish our class with a Satoma Mantra together. Feel free to share with me. Uh, if you cannot, just be silent and get positive energy together. Take a nice deep inhale. Oh Om Asatoma Satagamaya Tamasoma Jotilrekamaya Mrityoma Amritam Gamaya Om Asatoma Satagamaya Tamasoma Jotilrekamaya Mrityoma Amritam Gamaya Om Asatoma Satagamaya Tamasoma Jotilrekamaya Mrityoma Amritam Gamaya Take a nice deep inhale Shanti 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 Bring your thumb to your forehead Exhale slowly bow down to the floor We thank you to the nature We thank you to the universe We thank you to the Lord Shiva We thank you to our master, our guru, our teacher And we thank you to yourself that you come to practice so beautiful okay namaste everyone